Fertilizers, fuel, feedstuffs, all costs that have risen for farmers. The IFA says some could even be driven out of business unless they get higher prices. Fertiliser costs are three times what they were before Christmas. We have to look at what we're going to do next year and simply the maths just don't add up. Climate is the other big issue. Farmers say they will work to reduce emissions, but production cuts are not acceptable. You know, the emissions we produce are you know, they're different emissions from other sectors and you know, we are playing our part here. And the risk here is... You know, it's about food production and this is why we are different and the world population is growing. Patisha spent 45 minutes engaging with the IFA delegates and gave them this warning. A significant change in climate will affect our production cycles and, and that's something that's not being, I think that's something we have to be aware of. That goes to the heart of farming. So are farmers seeing climate change in their fields? Yes, there probably is a slight change in, in the climate. I don't think it's as dramatic as it's being uh, pointed out to be. Yeah, there is a shift, there is a change, but at the same time, you will have the different events every year. Um, so the same amount of grass will grow. Research is ongoing into technologies like improved genetics for livestock, smarter use of fertilisers and special additives to feed stuff, which it is hoped will deliver cuts in carbon emissions. The IFA wants time given for them to be developed. But today the Taoiseach warned if they do not deliver, more will inevitably be asked of farmers. Coleman O'Sullivan, RTE News.